this is RV and welcome to my cosplay channel. I am so excited to share with you with my new video. This is the KDA All Out Evelyn Makeup Tutorial. And now let's begin! To start off, we begin by wearing our contact lenses. This one is from Diorella Prestige Contact Lenses. It's the perfect contact lens for your Evelyn cosplay. And it's time for the makeup. Actually, this makeup is almost as the same as the KDA Evelyn Baddest tutorial, so I decided to give a refresher on this one. Here, I'm using the Elmer's Washable Glue. Apply it on both eyebrows, and afterwards, allow it to dry. So while waiting for the glue to dry up, apply the foundation that's needed for this cosplay makeup. First, you're gonna use it for the base, and the lighter color will be on concentrated on the cheeks, on the forehead and on the chin. So once the glue is dry, you're going to apply the translucent powder on your eyebrows. Allow it to bake. And now it's time for the concealer. You're going to apply it on the under eye, on the sides of the nose, and on the sides of the lips. And it's time to set the foundation and the concealer with the translucent powder. Actually, the foundation powder is optional, but for me, I'm just going to apply it just to balance out my translucent powder. And back to the eyebrows, you're going to reapply the Elmer's Washable Glue. While waiting for my eyebrows to dry, I decided to apply the first base eyeshadow color. I have an upcoming video on this eyeshadow palette, so stay tuned on that one. For the second color, you're gonna need a blue velvet eyeshadow. For the middle part of the eyeshadow, you're gonna need a creamy mineral teal shade. For the fourth color, you're gonna need a violet shade of eyeshadow. Because I know my eyebrows are going to be so elevated, so I just had to add this extra violet color on the top of the lilac color. And now we're going for the lips. To emphasize the shape of the lips just like Evelyn's, I decided to use a lip pencil just perfect enough to match the shade of my lipstick. For the lipstick, I'm using Vice Cosmetics Good Vibes Matte Lipstick in Bongage's shade. And now it's time for the eyebrows. I would like to apologize because I wasn't able to make a video on applying the foundation and setting it on with a powder. So before making a drawing, like a draft drawing on Evelyn's eyebrows, so you're gonna need to put them on and then let it dry and add the eyebrow pencil drawing on the Evelyn eyebrows and then follow the liquid eyeliner. So I just hope you can get what I'm trying to say here in this part. And remember, eyebrows are sisters, not twins. As you can see, there is some space in there, so I decided to put on the violet eyeshadow and make it sure that you blend it well to the other colors applied.
And now for the liquid eyeliner. It's the same one that I use for the Evelyn eyebrows. Actually, what I've noticed about Evelyn's makeup in the KDA All Out illustration is that um, it's more of a fierce, retro, edgy vibe. It's particularly a match of her characteristic in the League of Legends game. And you're gonna add some contour on the sides of the nose bridge and on the sides of your nostrils and on the sides of the lips and on this middle of the lower part of your lip. Actually, there was a video on the highlighter but unfortunately it got corrupted so really apologize. Just in case if you wanna know, I just put it on the middle of my nose and on the nose bridge and on the sides of the cheekbones and on the middle of my chin. This one is optional. If you have a holographic lip balm, then it would better add more beauty on your lips. And yes, you're gonna be needing some false eyelashes. Uh, the ones that I'm using is from Ding Sen False Eyelashes. I actually have a review on this one, so uh, you can check it out on my playlist. And add some mascara on your natural eyelashes and on your lower eyelashes as well. You're gonna need some pink blush on, just put it on your cheeks and then after you're gonna be needing a bronzer, just a little dab on the lower cheekbone. I actually decided to put some bronzer on the sides of my face and on the top of my forehead just the side on the forehead and then on the sides of my chin because I just wanted to make it more defined and as near as Evelyn's face shape and once done you're gonna unveil the final look of KDA All Out Evelyn It took me months to prepare this uh, particular KDA character and a lot of courage because I am not used to with wearing such daring wardrobes. And yes, of course, Evelyn is an exception because she is my favorite League of Legends character ever since then. Thank you so much for your time and I hope you learned something from this tutorial. This is Zarvi saying, bye darlings. <laughs>